everyone, and welcome to week seven of the Junior Grand Prix, coming to you from Enya, Neumark, Italy. It is made up of several mountain communities with a population of just around 300,000 people. It is primarily a wine and apple industry and tourism for a large part of the season. It's a great winter sport area and now hosts a new arena. It's unusual that such a small community has such a beautiful skating facility. But then again, the vision of the local people is one of full delivery of skating from a child to champion. Welcome inside the Worth Arena here in Enya. I'm your host, Ted Barton, and we are in a spectacular small mountain community with a beautiful skating facility. And this week, playing host to the final Junior Grand Prix event of the season with lots at stake for many of the skaters. Top score is going into the final event. In ladies, top score finally changed from week one with Alina Kostanaya of Russia producing a beautiful performance of both sport and art, earning a new top score of 197.91. In men, producing a top performance in men's top score remains with Alexei Yarikov of Russia with a 232.79. And in pairs, a new top score came out of Gdansk with Ekaterina Alexandra Voskaya and Harley Windsor of Australia producing a 167.26. And finally, in dance, there was also a new top score delivered by Anastasia Skopkova and Kirill Alishin of Russia with a strong performance earning a 150.78. It's week seven, time is running out, pressure is on, and the last chapter will be written here in Enya Neumark, Italy. And it all starts right now.